Welcome to F-Riders. I'm Dave Brandt, the Motorcycle Safety Program Manager for the Department of the Air Force. As summer approaches, we want to make sure you have the tools you need to become a DAF rider yourself. Check it out. Step 1. Acquire a permit, as a minimum, from your local Department of Motor Vehicles. Did you know that a permit or license is required to attend any Air Force sponsored course? Step 2. Contact your MSR. They will explain the process of setting up your MUST account and can assist you in signing up for your DAF approved basic riding course. Could you help me? Oh, of course. Come on. I'll show you. Yeah. Step 3. Attend your BRCU or approved level 1 course. Upon successful completion of your course, you will be issued a completion card. In some states, your completion card can be used to acquire a state license endorsement. It is vital to your riding safety to work on and practice the exercises from your course. Step 4. Log your efforts into MUST. Load your training and motorcycle into MUST. Note your training due date for your next level of training. This should be level two. Step five, sign up for and complete your next training within six months, not to exceed one year. Step six, load your efforts into MUST. Load your new completion card into MUST and ensure all rider information and motorcycles you have are loaded correctly. Note your next training due date. Be aware that briefings must also be updated annually in MUST. We recommend you take a course every year to hone your skills and keep that skills scale moving north. Do you practice or just twist a throttle? Consider investing in your own training at any of the amazing courses available around the globe. Remember, skills building is a journey, not a destination you can reach. Now you know the steps to become a DAF rider. Remember, practice makes precision, so stay out there and stay practicing. If you have further questions, reach out to your local MSR for help. And as always, keep it shiny side up.